As the regional district and the CTERRA program move forward with the plan for Greater Victoria sewage treatment, there is another idea on the table. A new plan from people who are pushing for a different solution. They call it the RIGHT plan, R-I-T-E. The acronym stands for Respectful, Innovative, Tax-Friendly and Environmental. And it's all about integrated waste management. CTV Stephanie Sherlock reports. You've likely heard of Stop a Bad Plan, the campaign against the CRD's current sewage treatment proposal. The old smelly treatment plant concept is just, you know, from the past. It's really the end of an era, and we could be building the last of the dinosaurs. Richard Atwell is the man behind it, and now he has a new plan, what he calls the right plan. It's very, very simple. There's just a pack that goes in the ground and it goes into multiple locations. It's an odor-free, it's a noise-free technology. It's highly compatible with neighborhoods and it's cost-effective. He proposes several tertiary treatment sites throughout the region, much like the system operating at Dockside Green. Instead of pumping sludge, the water would be squeezed out and the dried remnants trucked to Heartland, where Atwell proposes the CRD build a waste-to-energy gasification plant. CRD is planning one facility for garbage, another facility for sewage when the two can be simply combined together. Solving the region's impending need for a solid waste solution as Heartland fills up. It could even deal with compost if and when that becomes necessary. It's, it's innovative, it's distributed, it's um, dealing with the problem and it's integrating solid and liquid waste management which is the way of the future. The gas that is produced can be used to fuel the trucks that transport the waste. Supporters say it just makes sense. We've never had a, a test run on anything to see if it would work. And these are working, so why not? Atwell figures his plan would cost around $650 million, a modest savings over the CRD's current plan. And Weaver says he's certain the province would approve a delay for the right reasons. The money is there. The money would be there for a delay for a delayment to 2020. This would allow some reflection, a pause. Technology has changed, and would it would allow the, the the region to get better value for the money. The CRD says more plans equal more money, and though it hasn't received any information regarding Atwell's plan, it has been looking at integrating waste streams. For more information, you can go to our website, VancouverIsland.ctvnews.ca. Stephanie Sherlock, CTV News, Oak Bay.